Hello everyone, my name is Yarkas Monkey and welcome back to The Walking Dead Episode 5. No time left. So, this may well be the final episode of Season 1. Hey honey, I think this is all gonna work out. What are you? I'm glad too. Whoa. Time's out. I wish it wouldn't have had to get this bad. But it's all over, hon. Isn't it? Just about. I hate seeing you like this. I just miss your smile, honey. I miss you so much, Tess. You're gonna like Clementine a lot, though. She's not Lizzie, but she's sweet. She wouldn't hurt a fly. <laughs> Ooh. There you go. Come on, come on, come on. Imagine this would be a lot easier if I had two arms. There you go. Choke him out! Come on! Keep going! Good. Ain't hurt no one no more. Fuck it, he can turn for all he, I can. He could come back. It's okay, sweet pea. We're leaving. Good. Good to have you back, Clementine. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Stuff. I'm sorry. Shh. It's okay, Clem. Okay. It's okay. okay no. Finally found it. Your arm's gone. Why? That's so scary. I had an accident. Talk about it somewhere safe. You don't smell good. Yeah, yeah I'm actually a stink from killing up all those walkers out in the street. Did he hurt you? No. Not really. I'm sorry, Lee. Okay, Clem. Clem. It's okay. He's gone now. We need to get you Just somewhere that. safe. And then we have to talk, okay? Yeah. What is in that bag? Everything's okay now. We need to figure out how to get out of Savannah as fast as we can. I'm just glad he's gone. I'm Them sorry set. you had to see that. He was going to kill you. And take you. Yeah. Which way out? Through there. Stupid question. So what is in here? Oh! What? Is that. Is that the wife's head? No, I know. Oh, that's disgusting. Alright, let's go. Shit! One bullet. It, it didn't bite you. Yeah, I know it. Must have. You're covered in all that gross stuff. Huh. Had to get through a bunch of them to get here. Yes, and this is what's. Oh, yes, we're gonna do what? That's how we'll get out of Savannah. Spoilers. What Rick and Glenn do in The Walking Dead in season one? Yep. Oh, jeez, this is gonna suck. <laughs> Oh boy. Oh no. Alright, thanks.
This is gonna suck. Sorry, Tran, but we gotta take this. Okay, I'm glad it's a PG set. We'll get you cleaned up as soon as we can. Not soon enough. Hmm. It'll be okay, girl. Are you done? A little more. I want to be sure. Just a little more. It's so gross. Okay, Clem, you'll be cleaned up soon enough. We'll get out of Savannah and then we'll clean you up. Oh, nice. And we'll get out of Savannah. I don't know how much time Lee has left. That do it. I hope so. Let's just go. And you're missing something. I thought it was gone. Oh, no. I thought you were gone. Thank you. It's okay, Clem. Okay. Stay right next to me. Very slowly. Don't look around and don't panic. Mm -hmm. I'll keep you safe. <laughs> so we're leaving the walkie talkie behind. Uh oh. Uh -oh. It sounds like a storm's coming. It's getting nice and easy to Again, it really does it. I've noticed us. Anything I will. That could have been bad. What's up, Clem? Oh no. That... It's apparent. Hey. Hey. Oh, shit. Lee, wake up. Please don't be dead. Please, no. Lee. Jesus, so you look like shit. You left me. I, I, I saw my parents. I know. They didn't get to you, right? No. Well, we got away. They're dead for sure. I'm sorry you have to see that part. Clementine, we have to get out of here as fast as we can. Well, we can't. There's thousands of them outside. We have to. Protect you. We'll push no, through. no, that's crazy. I saved you. We're safe here. I locked us in. Get that door open. I can't. Do it. It was only a little open when I found it. I closed it to keep us safe. Pull on three. One, two, three. <laughs> <sighs> <coughs> I don't think Lee's got it in him to do this anymore. See? Clementine, honey. My arm is gone because I cut it off. Why would you do that? Because I was bitten, Clem. Please, no. No. 
that's not true. Yes, it is. Sorry, Club. <laughs> I'm sorry, Clementine. I'm supposed to take care of you. I can't now. I know. Pretty sure we can do it, though. We need to find them, though. I think there might be a way out over there. It looks like it's some sort of win. What is that? A window? Good, good girl. Let's go. I might be a little slow. Ah! Oh, steady, Nick. Help you. It's a walker. Yeah. <clears throat> I got you. You can lean on me if you have to. I'm okay. Okay. I thought I was helping by bringing you in here. Be good, Clem. Oh, you did, honey. It's awful out there. But they would have chewed me up. It was hard. I don't know how you did it. But you did good. Okay? Keep going. We're almost there. Get up, Lee! The door is right here! Come on, get up. <sighs> I can't. You have to! Ma'am, I can't move. This is it for me here. Please, please, try to get up! Come on, one last try then. Not much time. You gotta do something fast. Like what? You need to get out of here as soon as you can. I I can't leave you. Just work on getting out, okay? We'll figure it all out. Don't worry. Let's see. Just start by getting that door open. It's locked. It's uh, no big deal. It's just a glass window. Uh, uh, ow! Not with your hand. I thought there's something around here that you can use. To smash. Ah, hello. There's a baseball bat under the counter, Clem. You can use that. to shatter that window so you can reach in, okay? Okay. Watch out for broken glass. Good job. Come, come, come. He's too small to reach in there. Don't be afraid of him, honey. You're smart. He isn't. You're smarter than all of them. Looks like he's trapped as well, anyway, so... Grab yeah. the chair, Clem. Use it to reach in to the lock. Go for the glass, Clem. Open it. He's, he's trapped. This will be easy, then. He's got keys. Probably to that door. And everything you'll need. There are handcuffs on the ground. Get them. Okay, Lee. Oh, it's a door. I thought it was a window. Oh. Make sure they're tight. I don't, I don't want to do this. You have to. 
It'll keep you safe. You only have to deal with him now. I'm still not picking it. I'm close to begin with. If you can I'm to the end. Get what you need from him. The keys. And then the gun. Yeah. The keys and the gun. Just don't be afraid. If anything gets dangerous, you're faster than he is. What should I get first? Um, gun. Get the gun, then. Always the gun. Oh no, he got free. Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! Come on, Clem, you can do this. What the? Watch out! Oh crap! Ow! Oh, the paper went. Clem, use this. Don't breathe that. Go on. Again, like episode one. <laughs> but this time, Clementine gets the kill. I did it. I got him. Great, then. Good job. She did good. Really old men fucking okay. guys. Clem, I was standing over Duck holding that gun. It was so hard. Sorry you're in that position now. I give anything for you not to be. But you just have to point it at me. Close your eyes and be thankful you never have to see me as one of them. You can do it. I know you can. Okay, Lee. I can do it. I I can. I don't mean it, Krista. They're outside of town, by the train. You remember how to get back there? <laughs> yes. Good. No. They'll take good care of you. <laughs> and Clem. <laughs> Not her sure. I will. I'll cut it myself. Great. Good. <sighs> and also. What? What is it? Be okay. It'll be okay. Oh, oh boy, this is not fun.
So concludes season one. Oh, here we go. Seventy-one percent of prize remove the arm. Twenty-five percent the prize kept calm with Kenny. Forty percent kept your weapons. Forty-two percent killed him. And nearly sixty-three percent made sure he didn't die. Oh, okay. here we go. Defended his son in the drugstore. Helped him down from the door in his son's face. He killed his son's face and him when he was lost with a herd trying to save Ben. He found water for a duck when he needed it and she shot herself on the face with the son's face. He called him a racist. <laughs> you trusted him with your axe despite his vendetta. Larry died in the meat locker at the dairy. I tried to revive him with CPR. I back her up when supplies went missing but I left her on the side of the road. Something good on the train, but we were separated after crossing the sign. I asked Ben to help me find Clem. That shows twice for some reason Ben fell to his death in the savannah alleyway. Trusted Carly with my past, she saved her life at the cost of another. She was killed by Lily, and I defended her against Lily. We met on the worst day thus far. You revealed her bite to her. You told her and I meet to meet the train. You asked her and I meet to take care of her. Doug was with me when I found Lily's brother, and he died when Walter started the drugstore. I saved Doc at the farm, defended him in Macon, shot him before he could turn, and I let him be trying to rob him and trying to solve the mystery. Oh, copyright! Uh, I'll see you after the credits, everyone. Oh, oh she made it out of Savannah. Oh, thank God for that. Oh, I'm guessing this is a hidden cutscene after the credits. Okay. Well, I'll, I'll cut the credits out because there was a song that played, uh, Take Us Back. Which, if I'd have played that in the credits, it would have been content ID for it. Fucking YouTube and its automated system that does not work, fix it! Sorry. Oh. oh. Someone's been here. There's shotgun shells. What are you looking at, Claire? Who the hell is that? A crystal I need? It looks like it. Is it then? Probably it isn't. The spike clamp. What? Oh, wow. And that's it. So concludes season one of The Walking Dead. It's been a great adventure playing through season one. It has been so much fun. There's been a lot of emotional feel feelings pouring out in this game. Telltale did an amazing job with creating this. And. The ending, I hope I did hold back a lot, but inside I was really turned off. That's probably one of the most emotional endings I've ever seen to a game ever. But tomorrow, 400 days begins, and then next week it begins season two. And there's what's available of it. So, thanks for watching, everyone. I hope you've enjoyed this first season. I know I did. Don't forget to leave your own sound below, like, favourite, share, comments. I really appreciate any feedback you can give me. It was a great journey. I really appreciate all the support I've had this far. And here's to the continuation of the series. 100 Days begins tomorrow with first character, whose name I think is Vince. But until then, thanks for watching everyone, and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.